All right, this is Ruben Lowing. It's my leadership talk for today. I'm here in the park. It's a little windy, but uh, I'm gonna go for a run. And uh, so I had an experience. I got somebody that's <laughs> engaged and uh, in a big way. And I can't even tell you, it's over a hundred contacts that she's given me to start calling. So I called like 44 of them yesterday, last night. And of the 44, I got 10 of them that I can build rapport with and told them about what we do, what she's gonna be doing with us. And they sent them the Saving Your Future book, got them in the counter, right? But of those 10, only two of them remember who she was, okay? But, of, but the other eight, I made a connection with, okay? And that did a lot for my confidence. Got me to think. Okay. The, uh, see, when I first came in this business, I saw what they were doing for people. I got it, like right now. And I was already successful in the mortgage and real estate business. But things weren't the way they used to be. You know, my phone wasn't, you know, I wasn't taking a bunch of up calls. I had to go hunt for them. I had to go and so and get referrals. And so I saw what they were doing. I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna take, I'm gonna, I know so many people in my database that are that need this kind of help. So I took him on 40 appointments. I went with him, gave him credibility, and sat there and listened to what he and all he did, he had a great degree in communications. He, and he had the the flip chart. He wouldn't. He didn't have. He didn't have to look at it, man. He just was, you know, had it memorized, just flipping right through it. He wasn't paying attention to nothing that they were reacting to, whether it was the rule of 72 or how taxes affect their money, or uh, you know, he didn't pay attention to anything except he was going through that flip chart. I was paying attention to what was getting their interest for what they wanted to talk about. And that's what I did last night. Okay. And I'm like, you know what? If I get, if I could get somebody to do what we teach, right? And open up their contacts to me and introduce me like I did when I got it, dude. The, the thing is that there's a barrier and it's, you know, you, you could you could say it's the license, licensing, but it's really not. It's the, if people, they won't help anybody unless they're gonna get paid, All right? And I'm like, whoa. Right? That's the wrong attitude. Right? What makes it in this business is somebody who truly has the heart to help people. This associate that gave me over a hundred people to call. You know, she didn't do it the ideal way. She didn't match me up with her people that she knew that you know she had the best relationship with, right? But she gave me all of those those names, right? And what I did is I'm real good at learning from the mortgage business, keeping a conversation log. So in in uh, in uh, Salesforce, there's a conversation log. You can so I write down the date and the time. First thing is who their what their name was, their full name first and last name and what we talked about and then I then the phone number and then I cut and paste that I put an email I sent it to her and to my CEO okay but there's a 
whole bunch that goes along with that is I know what to talk to them about next time we call. I know when we talk, all right, and uh, it, it brings us further into a relationship and to get to what is it that they want and that they need. Okay, it's, it's all about knowing your client, knowing who you're talking to, okay? And you can't do that, or I'm not gonna say you can't. It's very difficult to do that in one sitting, okay? But the way I'm treating this associate is modeling how, and she'll do good. She's all right, I can tell. She's already, you know, that kind of person, very conscientious, right? And that's exactly what we need. But the confidence, all right, is where the make or break is, okay? And, uh, you know, if, if somebody's lacking confidence, you gotta figure out what they're lacking is. Is it, is it, is it in them? You, it's not you know. It's, it's hard to say it's with the company because of who we are and what we do. It's, it's you know all these programs work if you work them. All right. So with that said, it's longer than I wanted to go. All right. It's you know you're drilling. All right. You get you know you start getting some success. People will throw at you their throwaway contacts. You know, they don't know them well enough, they don't have enough relationship with them, so if things don't go well, it's like sticking a finger in a glass of water and taking it out for them. Well, you gotta treat it the same way. Okay? You're just, you're looking for the winners. Okay? And if you know how to communicate with people, give you a hint. No, you talk about the campaign first, okay, and then the financial the training. Okay, you're training the new associate to train other people about finances, okay, and uh, and then you go form family, occupation, recreation, and money. All right, your message. Right. And in there is how where you'll find